Hey, what's up, everybody? Getting back into YouTube again. Because I have a ton of stuff that um I have to rip that I've been saving. And I have a bunch more of uh, old school stuff coming tomorrow. Um, Got to get my subscriber count back up and views up and, you know, all that stuff. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to have a little giveaway and contest here. Um, just subscribe and comment below. And your comment has to be about the World Series. <clears throat> and um, I'll probably do it after Game 5. Since it has to go at least 5 games. Just uh, comment who do you think is going to win it and how many games. Um, I'm a big Phillies fan. So, <laughs> I mean, yeah, I thought it was going to make a difference. But your guests will get you um, some cards tonight. So I'm going to do a little box where from 2020. Um, my prediction is Series 1 is probably going to win. Um, update was mm, not so good because of the, you know, pandemic and stuff. And I was trying to look at these odds and look how much different they got over the mm, two years. Even from Series 1. Like, they jumped up a lot. Hopefully you can see all that. And Independence Day is 1-75 one, one in and now it's 1-87 in over here. So, um, I have the old Beckett out to kind of help give a, a thing, take a guess which is going to win. Um, I'll do what most people do, a top five on the board. But, uh, don't forget, um, you know, your prediction and subscribe and comment. And you can win some of these cards. But also, um, at the end of the video, or close to the end or somewhere, I'll tell you about how to get some free cards and some... Some other free stuff, some free credits, um, where people sell and whatnot, and I'll be able to give you, what the heck, uh, these usually pop open on the side, which is weird, uh, I don't know what I'm thinking, I guess we'll just have to break it like this, alright, it's been a while since I opened these, and you know what? Chris Ayadana, man, he doesn't even play anymore. I had no idea that he was even on the Yankees. Let's see. Hmm. Who knows? We'll find out what's in here. Try to get a little pile going then. I want to say Nestor Cortez is in here. That he may be the first main rookie, um, I think. I know, like, you were on in them, but... I consider, you know, the ones from here, the real rookie cards. Okay, so, no, nothing. Oh, Nico Horner. See, I like him. I think he's going to be um, pretty decent. I don't see just the rookies. Keep the other piece up. There's so many guys that, oh, that's all they got to come up because of the pandemic. Mm. Man, yeah, guys I never heard of. And I didn't open a lot of this stuff because... There was a lot of repeats. I mean, Joey Votto. I mean, so he's probably going to be a future Hall of Famer. And why are these cards going every which way? I mean, pool holes, so he's always decent. I mean, he's good. I mean, it's a decent card to get. Also, now, Kershaw. Rich Hill. I have a ton of this card. All these repeats. All the home runs because they didn't have those all star inserts that you see. All the old school stuff. I know that 2022 update came out. I mean, I guess that's better than... You know, this this stuff here. Go compare another future Hall of Famer. I mean, guys, you just never... I mean, maybe they came up when they were really young. But, okay, Mo. An insert. Oh, okay. A pool holes foil. That's definitely going to be in the top five. Mattingly? Mattingly always sells very well. I know a lot of people collect Mattingly. Eddie Murray. These turkey reds, they're like in everything. Oh, a Jeter turkey red. That's definitely a decent card. Justin. Okay, now I heard this guy is going to be pretty good. Um, born in 98, so okay. He's going to be, well, February. He's going to be 25 to start the season. I heard he has a lot of power. Die France, Terry Marte. I guess there was no short prints. Another one. And Giancarlo's 
decent. I just kind of like sort out like common base to, you know, Hall of Famer star types. Granky, he potentially could be a Hall of Famer. Kershaw, all these sideway cards that people seem to hate. Oh, Pete Alonzo. Chris Bryant, I mean, he had a decent career. He's still playing, but he's, he's hurt too much. Glaber. There, there you go. There's a good one. That's the one I was thinking of. There you go. Nasty Nester. I mean, he had late bloom to his career. Born in 94. Hmm. Oh, Verlander. Let's see what he does in World Series. Okay. Well, I think I got five here. Uh, I would say... Ooh. I mean, Nestor Cortez is probably one. Cortez, Pujols. I mean, Jeter. People will probably pay more for that Jeter than they would anything else. And maybe Nico and... Uh, surprisingly, I think people would rather have that Mattingly. Alright, well, like I said, you have a chance to win one of these cards. Or some of these cards. I mean, nobody wants these. some of these pastes that are over here. But, um, like I said, just give me your prediction on the World Series. You know, by Game 5. Make sure you subscribe and comment. Also, um, like I said, I had some free stuff to give away. Uh, we're going to do... I have uh, the links below. I mean, sure, most of you are familiar with Whatnot. And also, there's a, an app that I use called Macari. So if you go on Macari, um, you can get $10 of free credit. And also, you can get, um, if you sell something, you can get like another $20 or $30 in free credit. So, make sure you check out those links below. Uh, but here we're gonna get into this. See, I'm 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 used to like these up here. Like you see how? Oh, oh, I'm knocking stuff over. These, they like open from the side and they have the plastic around it. I definitely prefer that over this. And like I said, the difference between these, like one in three or one in seventy-five for a look at Independence Day now is one in one hundred and forty-seven. And that's series one. What do you think update is? One one hundred and forty-seven. This was Independence Day. Well, see now the Independence Day on this one is only one in seventy-nine. But I mean series one. I mean they obviously make more of series one than they do like an update set. All right, let's try this. I don't know. Boba Shets, Yordans. I'm pretty sure they're both in here. It's been a while. This is the Walmart version. I have a, I have the other one sitting up there. That's a Walgreens version where you can find those exclusive yellows. I remember the Yordan was going for like easy forty dollars raw, but you know how the prices are of everything now. So here we go. Doesn't look like there's anything thick in it. The die cut, you can tell there's a die cut just by looking right there. Well, Aaron Judge on the front. It's probably, that might make the top five. He had a great season, obviously. Free agent. I like to also hear your guesses. Do you think he's going to stay with the Yankees? Because... I definitely think he's going to stay with the Yankees. Patrick Sandoval, rookie. I mean, I think he's he's decent. Not top, top five worthy, probably not. Scherzer's. Chance this go. See, he was up for well, all those prospects they had. Nick Solak. Whatever happened to him, I think he's still playing. Jay Bruce, I remember when he was on the team. Obviously, Phillies fan. Robel Garcia, he's playing in Korea now. I just looked that up. 
Oh, we got Arenado and Yelich. Oh, that's a that's a nice one. Boba shit. Oh, I like it. Oh, I need to find something. There you go. Zach Gowan. He had a heck of a year. A run. I don't make top five. At Conforto. He didn't even play this year. Oh, these are these Hoskins too. You get Hank Heron. Die cut. Yeah, somebody will probably like that over those other beasts. And probably this Rivera insert. He sells well. You know what I mean? I don't think that's John Means Ricky. No. He did throw a no hitter that year, I think. Dietrich. With, when they did the sleeveless ones. No wonder shit. Arenado. Aaron Savali. I mean, I was big on him for a little bit, but after that performance against the Yankees in the. What? I don't know. Was that the Game 5? Or whatever. Game 3? Three, 3. Yeah. Another Verlander. Oh, man, we gotta find something. Austin Riley, future star. Too bad it wasn't a rookie. Bubba Starling. Man, he was a he was a big time prospect. I guess he was number one pick, or he was a first pick by the Royals. He was a hot commodity at one point. So much hit or mess with stuff. No, he could bear. Oh, Shohei. Love Shohei. Buster Posey. Charles Berg. Mitch Hanniger. Soto. I mean, that's tough to find something good in this. Glaber. Gary Cole. Caleb Smith. Ah, oh, Scherzer. Funny thing is, is this card or. Pretty sure this 2020, I pulled like a, a patch of Scherzer to 25, like those World Series patches. Like out of just like a random retail pack. I was like, that was awesome. It was like the, because every year I, until I got back in again, I would just buy some packs or definitely like some tops. And that was definitely a surprise pull. Man, we're getting to the end here. Sean Murphy. I mean, he's decent. Plays with Oakland, so there's not much. Oh, man. I think I... I think that's probably the top five. I mean... I'll go through some... I mean, these are all the stars. I don't... I mean, Otani... Somebody want a tiny base over? Oh, these aren't what the heck happened here. These are all the not good ones. <laughs> I think I was messing up my piles. Yeah, there. I mean, I don't see anything else worthy of going in there. I mean, these are the other inserts in the zone. I mean, a f rainbow foil. I mean, rainbow foils, they are harder to get. And there's no other notable rookies. No. All right, guys, so. Also with your prediction. Tell me which one you like. Somebody's gonna win some stuff. Hank Aaron, I guess, die cut. I don't know. Judge Murphy and Mo. So which one do you think is better? Was it the Nestor? Box one, which was the update. Nestor, Pujols foil with the Jeter Turkey. Nico Horner rookie. Or debut one in the Mattingly insert. I mean, yeah, I mean, they're $10 boxes, so and this one has a Zach Gallon rookie. Yep, the Hank Aaron die cut, a Judge base, a Mo insert, and a Sean Murphy rookie. 
So don't forget, I'll send some links down below for the for the WhatsApp and the WhatsApp. I keep saying WhatsApp, <laughs> whatnot, and the Macari, and also subscribe and comment your World Series prediction. And win some cards, and the links will give you some some money off. You know, help the hobby out. Enjoy.